Hello, welcome back to Age of Empires 2. I'm playing the map CBA Hero Perfect Edition. I think that's a bit of a stretch, but um, it is it is possible. Unfortunately, it's a it's a free for all game, and I'm playing as the Celts, which is going to be pretty difficult to make work. But we'll see what we can do. We're next to the the Goths, so that is a, a fairly good thing to happen. The map is not amazingly made. I mean. <laughs> The cursed towers are actually hitting each other from within the base, but yeah. I'm gonna see if I can snipe some heroes or something because I think I'm gonna draw them out with this attack. There we go. Let's see if we can snipe one of those. Can it be done? There we go. We got it. We got one. Time to go. Okay, the lag. The lag caused me to lose one, which is really annoying. That's very frustrating. So it's one for one. But as long as we keep fighting this guy, we might actually get the kills we need. I don't really want to go back now because of the, uh, the scorpions. I would just take way too many losses. Not sure if I can get an extra 10 bonus kills for going in the middle, but we'll check it out. Yeah, we did. Okay. Still not many kills. Uh, we are under attack. I'm not sure what to risk here. Uh, go on, then. let's go after this. I'm sure I can catch these things out, but I need to be very careful. See, I think he's spotted me now. There we go. Okay. That's all good. And now I can bring my own. Hopefully do the same to him. Except defend a little better. I can see his hero there. Let's see if I can catch this thing out. I think he's being a bit a bit rash with that, but we got away with it. Just watching this hero, it's going to change everything. If I can snipe that. I can see that thing coming at me. Let's see if I can kill it off. It is incredibly fast. Too fast, in fact, for me to actually catch up to right now. I need to look out for his hero. I'm pretty sure it'll be coming back out soon. I see it now. And it looks like I managed to finish off the elephant, so that's all good. And I think I'm gonna... Yep, I got the kill. Okay. So he's pretty much got no heroes left now. He might have the, uh, the Mameluke still, but that's got to be about it. And I should be able to get a raise as well pretty easily. Get myself some villagers. Okay, I see it now. That's the one thing he's got left, so I need to look out for that one. And I am now up to heroes. Gotta be very careful not to get caught out. I mean, if no one else is going to come over, then this is fairly good for me. I think he's going to try and be a bit more protective of that final hero. But that's okay. Don't want to risk these so much. More villagers. Yeah, he's much more protective of that of that final Mameluke, but that's okay. I'm fairly, fairly happy with how this is going. I should do some upgrades. Just don't really want to take my eye off what's going on here.
Now these things could be killed off very quickly. Just gotta be careful of that. One of them might actually get trapped here. Okay, I was worried starting in this game, playing as the Celts, I thought that I'd probably struggle to get kills, but since it is just me against the Goths, it's a pretty fantastic matchup for me. I'm up to Robin Hood now. Just need to keep the kills coming. And since there's a bit of lag, I can actually start using these villages a little bit. Gotta be careful though. Just making themselves vulnerable going in there. Seems to have a mind of his own. I think I'm ahead of the other players. Unfortunately, I, I don't really have time to check the actual game instructions, so I, I don't know if there's like a, a super Khan or anything like that. If it maxes out with just normal Genghis Khans, then it's going to be a lot harder. But if it just keeps going, I think I might actually be able to win the game. Yellow seems to be doing really well as well. Let's start building some some more serious bombard towers since we've pretty much won the fight against him. Still can't really beat Huskars though, with what I have so far. I don't really mind risking the villages, it should be fairly easy for me to get more raises if I really need them. But in the meantime, it should draw them out a bit. Oh crap, okay, here we go. We've got a problem. We're probably gonna snipe both of them. Certainly at least one of them. I was not expecting anyone to show up here. We can use it to get a few more kills, that's all good. And we've got a few more villages if we need them. In the meantime, Bombard Towers should do pretty well against all of these units. Orange is still coming at me. Ah, I see now, okay. So, uh, I didn't notice that the purple player has resigned, so that would explain why Orange is now suddenly paying attention. Might have accidentally given him villages there, but probably not. I mean, I don't think I've lost any other buildings, so that's all fine. Theodoric the Goth. Let's get some more of these while we can. Siege workshop units, extra HP, that could come in pretty handy. Okay, I've, uh, I've lost track. I've not lost any of my hero units, so I'm not too worried yet. Other than the ones I lost at the start of the game, of course. I can actually... I can build? I can actually produce units. I could have been doing that the whole time, but never mind. It's not held me back too much. He is going out of his way to kill my villagers. I see that. That hero there, if we can try and snipe that. I think he's going to be pretty careful with it though. Fighting two players at once, potentially dangerous, but potentially also very lucrative indeed. Let's draw back here. Pull everyone in. Very slightly risk my scorpion here. Yeah, 
Green is dead, defeated in fact, and uh, I realise now I can have a look at the entire map, see how I'm doing compared to everyone else. And uh, I do appear to be behind yellow, which is a shame. Not by too much though. Got to be very careful, got to get ahead of him somehow. He's getting fed lots of kills here. I might have to go in and take Teal on with the remaining Theodorix. I should be able to take on Robin Hoods pretty easily. I think there's an argument for sending in the Ballista, it's a little bit risky. Could give me a lot of kills very quickly though. Let's try and sneak this hero. I'm guessing the scorpion died. I c oh, there it is. Okay, he's actually alive still. I'll be so careful here. I see that. I see that. He's coming after me. I think he sees that there's two of me and only one of him, so he's being fairly careful. Um, I'm guessing the scorpion has died. Yep. Okay. Not surprised he went out of his way for that. I, I still think that's a reasonable thing to do, just to try and catch up to, uh, to yellow a little bit. Here. I'm not sending him out yet. Still going for raises. I'm going to actually delete that. A little bit cheap, but that's what you got to do. No rules against it. kills as possible from these guys. Pair up to Genghis Khan, what about this guy? Not quite yet. So I'm slightly ahead at the moment, this is probably the point where I need to start actually trying to kill players off, and uh, I probably need to get some more villages and start making rams and things. So I will go and do that. He's really not very far behind at all. Fortunately I've got two of these guys coming after me at once. Make some siege workshops. One thing Genghis Khan hates, it's rams. Looks like Orange is holding back now, which is fine with me. And I've still got my two heroes. Just try and get as many easy kills as possible. bit of a lull at the moment which might give me a chance to look at what actually is going on with this map. I see you can build castles. Getting these kills while I can. Red's dead. Yellow's going for someone else. I'm not, like, desperate to try and kill people off. He's going for raises. Might catch him. Nope. 
Too risky. Nope. That's the problem with him being the same type of unit as all the others, is he, he tries to run along with them. Let's actually have a look at how this works. I see that yellow is coming for me now. Super Genghis Khan and it goes all the way up to 3,000 kills and then, in fact, it goes all the way up to 6,000 kills with very fast spawns, so... Need to actually get a bit smarter about this and be ready for whatever yellow wants to do. Take my easy kills while I can. Pretty much how CBA Hero works. It's, it's all about just trying to get as many kills as possible. I think um, Yellow is probably slightly more organised than me, although he's not built that many buildings, so perhaps not. I also wonder if there's some way I can keep producing Charles Martels. No. They are far more useful just for taking on the Rams. If Yellow's not going to make rams, then I will. I think he has actually stepped it off a bit now. Which is a shame. wonder if I can snipe him. It would be very difficult. I might actually make some road raiders just to deal with these rams a bit more easily. Yeah, he's not far behind me at all. Okay. Make a few stables just to build paladins, which are going to be a lot more effective than road raiders. Or well, they're easy prey for the Khans. Don't want to build that one. I'm actually getting pretty blocked off here. Yeah, that's really bad. Um, how can I? Increased spawn range. Spawn outside of the bases, please. Is that his main calm? Oh, it actually is. Wow, tame lane. Yeah, he's still got everything, I think. He's going to be a big problem. I don't actually want to do that yet. Player 5's gone, that's my feed. Let's go and try and thin this guy out a bit.
Orange is hanging on, but... Mm. I guess he's feeding me more than I'm feeding him. If I can kill this off, that would be really nice. <laughs> but he's watching it like a hawk. Okay. Not quite sure how to handle this then. Mm. The thing is, he has more heroes than me. Much more heroes. As in, the actual superheroes. If you can call them that. That tame lane could literally finish me off almost immediately. I suppose one thing I could do is try and hide my Khan. With all the, my other Khans, maybe? Perhaps if I can catch him out as well. Finish one of these heroes off. I think you'd see it coming. Especially with this lag. Give him some time to look around. Get him. Yep, yeah, got him. Good. Okay, that's all I wanted. Still got the Mameluke, but it's a start. Let's send all these villagers to build some more siege workshops. Gotta be very careful. thinking about blue. I suppose I should have left yellow to finish him off. He's killing off lots of my rams unfortunately. Okay, Mega Genghis Khan, let's see. Super Genghis Khan. It seems to be exactly the same. Am I missing? Oh, he's up to Mega Genghis Khan, not me. That's it. that's really bad. And uh, I lost a lot of momentum there. Bloodline's very overdue. One thousand HP and a hundred attack. Not bad. Hero somewhere. Looks like that's going fairly well. Let's actually bring these in. Feeding some of those paladins. More siege workshops just because. 
why not? Too many villages. I guess I should just fill the map with bombard towers, see what I can get away with. Two heroes still alive. His Mameluke's gone somewhere. It's there now. Saladin. Ah, crap. Okay, he's still ahead of me. I need to try and get myself a few more kills. Let's see if I can snipe the Saladin as well. That makes me a bit more confident. What about Orange? He's actually still alive. Let's try and get some kills from him. Okay, we're up to Ultra. I feel like I could probably snipe him. But he's still got his scorpions. Scorpion defense could be a problem. I should probably stop the villager spawns as well, but honestly, I'm just kind of focusing on other things right now. I think at this Ultra Khan level, they're going to be killing Rams in one shot anyway, so 
really it's just going to be about numbers. How does he actually compare to these guys? Hmm. Okay, I really need to actually win the unit fight. I think that's the only way. Let's see if these actually do go down in one shot. Yeah, they do. Okay. I actually need to gather up units. That's the only thing I can do. Just overwhelm. Kills. I think I just need to go after orange, finish that off. Let's see. He's building siege workshops, which I think it's a bit late in the game for that, but I mean I'm, I'm perfectly happy for him to make a mistake. If I can just actually get these guys together. I guess castles are the only thing that's gonna take more than one shot from these things. But yeah, the villages are probably more or less pointless now. Here we go. Troll is just kind of sending everyone all over the place, which is a shame. And these rams are doing probably more harm than good. Looks like my Mega Khan is actually trapped there. Hopefully not spotted though. Yeah, I just don't have many units. I mean, hmm. They're producing kind of slowly. That's another thing. No, 
I'm not you at the front. Come back. Let's try and catch him out with the troll. They just kill each other. <laughs> like, whoever gets the first shot pretty much wins the fight. from that fight until they are distracted by all these rams. Get some more kills. Get some more cans. Finish those off as well. It's all about numbers now. Catch him out. And I think probably also keep the Cavaliers coming. Just as fodder. Oh man, okay. He actually got he got one of my heroes. The Khan. As he kept running out with everyone else. Saladin's still alive. Blues Khan's just taking kills. I should probably go and deal with them. They're not really a threat to me. If I actually fight them with my units, but looks like we've got to take the main fight now. Ah, he's leaving. I doubt I can snipe him before he goes, but I will try. very kind. I wouldn't say it was in the bag. But now it is. And there are lots of kills to be had here. Looks like the, uh, the Bombard Towers have actually successfully dealt with blue. I mean these guys, <laughs> 2,500 health, 1,000 attack, it's it's over. I'd be surprised if they get one more kill. Try and deal with this guy as well.
He will get a few more kills. His defenders out. I think he's still got his scorpion defense. Let's make him use it. No, he's just gonna let me have it. Okay, cool. Over here, I'm getting <laughs> insane numbers of villagers. Player 7 is now the game master, I think that's just because the host is gone. Three cans, can they do it? One can, there we go, just in time. Sweet. GG. Fair play to him for hanging on that long. The thing about CBA heroes, when someone gets momentum, it's pretty hard to catch them up. But yeah, that was uh, very intense. That too. <laughs> very much focus on the gameplay more so than the commentary, but I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next video.